Hello. This is um, The Hype by Penny Peninsula. I hope you like it. 1 a.m. Saturday night biology. Two chapters, 50 pages. Music from the house next door, some kind of rager. Waiting for tonight, putting in time for the rest of my life. Saddened because it's not me but them that are missing out. Out, how do I get out? Oh brother, where art thou? In a moldy basement, drunk on cheap vodka, jaded, faded, labeled, sedated, satiated, plain. Like the way the freshman girl looks waiting to gain 15 extra pounds with her cleavage exposed and the cold for the sake of desire, a coat she went without. Out, in, underneath, inside, perspective, 3D, from the inside looking out, down. She can't tell with all that makeup she looks like a clown or perhaps a mime, stoic, wasting time, searching for approval, ignorant to the fact that the key to freedom lies in the removal of the makeup and the doubt. It was all of them that got it wrong trying to live the college life right. Cause see, right behind the alley, I was there, since barely there, shotgunning beer, with this glossed over, look how I'm supposed to look, watch what you say, magazine replica stare. But more than I cared what they thought, the real problem was that I just didn't care. It was through my own walls that I needed to tear, dare to find myself and look from the tops of the trees of my own mind, to see what I could find, and without any fear, love what was there. Discover it and like the most basic preschool concept, learn to share. Funny how in this higher learning institution that everything I need, I had learned a decade before life ever brought me before I ever got here. I learned to say please and thank you and that time goes slower from the timeout chair and that when you do good shit, you get good shit. But one adage I will never forget, life is not fair. And it's okay to cry when you're sad, band-aids, fix boo-boos. I'm too old not to wear a bra and all the parts of the train ride at the mall are all connected. But you have to be in the front seat to ring the bell and it's the only place your voice will carry. It's the only place your voice will carry. An echo as you chug a lug and woo-hoo. From the caboose, you're always the last man standing. But being last isn't always losing because you can see what's coming before you get there. I learned to wait your turn and not to say bad things about people when they're not there in lieu of God bless his heart, in which case your intentions are good and instead of a foul ball, you're in the clear, fair. Funny the exceptions we make to the rules we created, thinking it'll save us. Actions speak louder than words, but you're the only one who can hear your thoughts. Somewhere from, somewhere between ear to ear, society fuels the fire to fear. We are all flawed, all ugly, imperfect, and in most cases don't think we really deserve it. Entitled, try beguiled. What the fuck did I ever do? Oh yeah, that's right. What the fuck I was supposed to and what I wasn't. It stings a little bit when memories hurt, doesn't it? Cause wasn't it the reason you made that CD for me, ma? So you could try to justify the way you treated me, ma? Justify, deny, lie, ignore, decide, choose, remove, cultivate, revive, thrive, Fucking fly die. Tick tock. Ah, uh, to my coy mistress, don't stop. Be easy, everybody. Until next time.